My name is Amy. I'm a final year medical student at Monash University um, and I recently completed my SIP placement at Bendigo Health. The really interesting thing was um, I got to participate in pain rounds, which are rounds that um, happen every morning with the acute pain services team. And we go around um, to patients who have been referred to us or are already on our list. And we kind of, um, uh, our goal is to care for their pain, essentially. Um, and this was really interesting because it kind of contextualized um, my project and the data that I was dealing with because I was actually seeing the decision making or the challenges um, that came with treating patients for acute pain. Um, although my SIP focused on post-operative patients specifically, um, I got to see everyone who had kind of difficult pain to deal with. And it taught me a lot about the different modalities of uh, medicine that we have to treat pain, um, especially opioids. Um, and it gave me a lot of insight and further understanding in the kind of um, challenges that we have when we prescribe opioids and what kind of um, thought processes go behind prescribing each kind of um, medication to every patient. In my future practice, I probably be more inclined to seek out opportunities like this um, or opportunities to become involved in clinical research um, as a junior cl clinician. So I feel like it was really quite an eye-opening experience for me. But I think the most memorable would have to be um, at the end where I created a PowerPoint presentation and I was able to present this to the entire anesthetics department at Bendigo Health. Um, and I kind of got feedback or like real-time um, um, uh, thoughts um, and comments on the not only my work but the results of the audit. So um, I think it's good that this is at least able to act as a baseline even if they don't make any immediate changes. As medical students I know that it's really hard to find opportunities like this and it's very rare that we get to do something and complete it from start to finish um, because um, I feel like that was also a part of why this was so valuable. I got to do the entire thing and see it to the end. So it's kind of your life for about six weeks. I'm just really grateful that I had the opportunity to be able to gain so many skills, learn from so many um, experts and people who have been doing this for a long time. Um, and yeah, I'm really thankful to the amount of support um, and guidance that my supervisors, Michael and Tusha, have given me throughout the process. It's a huge opportunity for them. I mean, it's an excellent opportunity for them to be able to participate in activities and tasks. The other thing is to, they, by doing all this, they develop their critical thinking, their critical writing. So I think it's a great initiative, uh, the scholarly intensive placement. And I think um, it will help both ways, the students as well as, as, well as the hospital um, to improve, improve on the standards of the clinical practice.